Okay, now doors are down. One's hell and location actually does get reviewed here. So up here, the compliant comes in though, actually catches on to two. Oh, that looks like they are going to actually be backing out all the way. I think they sold this enough here that it pulls the rotation out there from Vision Strikers. But I think they realize what's going on now. They're trying left. to get back as soon as they can. But the push is coming here from the market side of things. But it's going to be Congred who's going to be able to get the two picks there onto King and Stacks. Not a whole lot that they can do. And look at this. It's going to be held here at the choke point from Spawn. Not a whole lot they can do. But Zest Spike and planted. the rest of Vision Strikers still trying to do what they can. He spots out his shoulder there. And Zest is going to be able to get the two shots. Shots to land. All right. The recon is probably really coming out there right now. Okay, this VS ready three man left. Boy, is still holding ground side there. You gotta be careful. Check the corners right there. There he goes down to RB with yeah, a headshot. Yeah. As well as Glow VRT. There is now one to four. All of a sudden, can he get the kill in time? No, it is not possible. A little bit of a rotation coming here. Zest trying to do what he can, but uh, PTC is still going to be able to land a headshot there. And now they're all starting to stream in here from market side of thing. The rotation is going to be coming from spawn, but they are going to have the dark cover in their way. It's not going to allow them to ingress here too quickly. But Ginny, he's watching the angles there from logs, and there's a whole, not a whole lot they can do. There's only going to be two players remaining here coming from mid and also spawn. I like how they're doing this though. They're really like holding the site before like actually planting. They want to clear the areas. They want to wait for like flankers and lurkers to come in. Pick them off before they actually get the plant there. So like very tactical play. I really like what's happening right now. Oh, Kongared and Jenny are going to stitch them up and, uh, you know, they're going to be locking down things on A side. Looks like the push is starting to come in here. They're moving through tree. They're going to be able to get their own dark cover onto that line of sight here. As they ingress onto side. King, though, he's not going to be able to sustain too long here as the push is coming in. Acidic's going to pick up the double here for his troubles. And now only two players left here for Vision Strikers. They are on the precipice of going down to that 3-0 uh, yeah. trailing here in this uh, early stages of the game. That's not good. I mean, they went for the anti-eco, and Triple A is looking to have like a, like you said, a 3-0 right now. Vision Strike. What is the right now? The Jet going to go over a wrap around. I think they might be, they might be forced to actually save this round. Yeah, I think uh, after you know just only being able to buy the weapons and then immediately getting shut down, this is a. Uh, going to be a little, little bit painful for them. Not, no, There's not that much of a, a bank yet just for the, the attack all round players that they really want to aggressively look. There's only going to be two play people looking to see if they can pick off any of the players, but uh, so far they're not going to be able to catch any inkling. But yeah, attack all round, they did manage to keep here for the defensive side. This is exactly what you need to do if you want to try and get some of these early picks when you have uh, lower weapons here at your disposal here. But PTC, he's going to punish Zest, not able to land the shots and now look at the sprays coming out here rb is not able to get the refrag straight away and he's actually going to be forced to fall back as uh, that's already going to be one of their their prize weapons given up and uh, this is already going to go as a straight upgrade here to triple a yeah ptc is on the roll i have no idea how he's doing these guys but they are already looking at entry that gets another frag on the rb bottom fly as well gets another frag on the flag that's all of a sudden two to five they are making their entry rotations coming aside for the b side but man Nose is on heaven. Oh, the plan so Thirty far. seconds left. Flooding almost on default there. Spike oh, planted. There it's uh, gonna be another save. It looks like. It's not looking well for Vision Strike. Oh, and uh, you know that positioning from Stacks there in Wine. That was a really good flash coming out. But unfortunately, I think they misjudged exactly how close the, the attackers were, and uh, RB actually got shot out before he could peek together after the, the flashpoint coming out there from the breach. Now there's only going to be Glow and he's going to continue to back out here as it's looking precarious. They're looking to see can they maybe nail any of these exit kills. Yeah, but he does only have a Ghost, just saying. And the Cypher's camera did spot him out or Triple A looking so strong. And we talk about the free upgrade, you know, economy, it, it does add up here. So it's going to be a steep hill to climb. Vision Stripe, I'm not like, counting them out yet. We do still have a couple of... Um, a couple of rounds to go to infer a little bit more about the movements of how VS likes to set up to try and compensate for that. Yeah, definitely gives for faster peaks there, but PTC, he's going to get punished there as RB finally able to take him down. Opening pick here for VS going to work wonders. Wanna Fly is also going to be suffering as now. It's going to be a three-man disadvantage, but Congress he's going to get one back. Moving into tree here, they're going to clear things out as they move onto site, but there's still going to be RB right there. He's going to get the triple here, and the flashpoint not doing a whole lot to him. He's going to pick up the 4k and finally we're seeing vision strike angle and get some more vision into a site but yeah it didn't work out too much uh, we didn't see 
a whole lot of poking and prodding before that. As you mentioned, mm -hmm. it was really quite slow coming out from them. But this is going to, again, be a little bit more measured approach. There's going to be the peek into mid here by RB, and he's looking to see can he capitalize. And he's going to get the double kill here off that collat. What a shot here as, uh, yeah, unfortunately not... And not, not coordinated enough from attack all around, and they're going to peak at the same time. Imagine double peaking in offer, uh, definitely not doing too well. That, wow, that, that wall bang though. I mean, human bang to yeah. say the least. Um, puts them up. Uh, I mean, puts them down a deficit of like two people now. And the thing out. is, all right, with the amount of people at Vision Strike has, they can easily hold two grounds without much worry. And plus, they have a cipher. Mm, yeah, and. Uh, this is actually probably going to start to work mm -hmm. against uh, attack all round, obviously. Now they're going to take their time and unfortunately rue that they didn't double peek at slightly different Page intervals three. there. But there's going to be Zaz popping around this line here. The, seconds left. the other reliable mm -hmm. offer here for Vision Striker. He's going to pick up the two kills. And now this is not a whole lot that PTC can do. Zaz is going to be able to finish things off. And you know, it's the players here from AAA moving here onto the B side. Rolling Thunder coming out there. They're going to hit Zaz. He's not going to be able to do much. He is going to stop the teleport coming in here, but that's going to distract him. PTC moving in here. Cedix also going to be following through. This is going to be devastating here against uh, Vision Striker. They have two players coming in. RB and Wannafly trying to see what else they can do. Sorry, it's going to be King, but actually now going to be on the legend side of things. There's still going to be the player all the way in the B main. He's going to get shot in the back there, and now they're going to try and bug out with the one operator that they still have available. Oh, Backstabber is the name of the game right now. He needs to save that. I mean, it is two to four, but uh, still a long way to climb up. Uh, okay, maybe we'll just give this one to Triple A. They played very well. They're coming out there. Actually, misses that off shot. That's totally fine. Jet on jet action. Um, she does have the nice up now, though. But what I like to see is some lurks. All right, yep. I want to see some, uh, uh, like I say, great lurks coming from the jet, maybe, and then. I think those pickoffs is gonna like make a lot of difference. The only risk in having lurks is that with these teams actually like all sticking together, if you're not very very low, actually 51, there's a cyber case comes out there. Now they are looking to make the entry here. RB gets one shot onto one of fly, one of fly is down now. A recon spots out RB right there. We have one and it's pop but flash. Still cannot clean that. Look at the smoke. The smoke are almost actually doing a lot to deviate their push actually. But actually, the, yeah, the push is going to be deviating quite substantially. I think they realized they couldn't really break in there after RB was able to reposition uh, to such an extent. And uh, yeah, we didn't see Acetix with the Hunter's Fury fast enough. Usually that's exactly why you're going to be sending in the Owl Drone first here. Get the opening pick, but Zest though, he is going to be able to get the collat. And that's the second collat that we've seen so far this game. And he's going to be backing out here onto the legend side of back of B. And now this is going to be a little bit difficult. Only two players left here for uh, Triple A. It's going to be Acetix going to be leading mm -hmm. the charge here and see whether they're going to be able to spot uh, any of the members. But look at all the angles being watched here. RB also from the spawn side, he's going to be rotating yep. around. 30 but seconds left. Have one more one enemy remains. as well. Dear God. Zest is popping off right now. He's one man left there. He spots him out there though. I am so sorry, but Jenny, you're going down. Yeah, that aftershock. <laughs> you get the information there. But uh, I think now this is still going to be a little bit ap of apprehension. But Zest, though, he's taking down the CTX. And I really love it when the uh, top notch uh, Sova player is really able to duke it out there through the wall. So now RB, though, he's going to be able to find out Concord. And now no more dark covers available. But oh, the combination here working out pretty well. RB, he can't see anything from days here. He's going to get pushed there by PTC after the two flash points working I well exactly. in unison. Now they are starting to push in onto site. Ginny, though, is coming in for the support. The fault line working onto glass here. Not going to allow any of the players here from BS to start to peek out. But now they are going to be taking half and PTC looking for more kills. He picks up his second of the round. They're pushing up the A ramp here, but Ginny is there. Yep, but they are, they are on site now, though. He has to make the communication. And it is an AWP, by the way, so they are on 30 site already. Left. Zest, uh, making his way slowly. Like I said, the Omen is on is in main. He will get this plant. Oh my lord. Ginny spots out Zest, and that's our AWP down. It's one on two, actually. Now. They get the clutch. That's one. The answer is no. Oh, Jenny coming up big there. I mean, is that a great move? Probably because it spills drone there. Will spot one. Uh, that is so unfortunate. PTC makes him watch. Now takes him out. Let's go down. Gets another frag onto stacks. And he is already on site. Triple H still has Tom. I'm called. Oh my lord. SS sticks. Glow going down with a the headshot. They are, like I said, they, they, they take their time. They don't even rush into the plant. They want to secure the site. Um, make sure there's no one 
in vicinity. They're looking to probably take this to a 7-3. Yeah, another save gonna be coming out here from Vision Strikers. Uh, not quite uh, uh, as close as uh, they would have liked it to be. But uh, yeah, attack all around, really delivering. PTC waking up here and carrying his team. And, you know, the, the teamwork that we're seeing coming out from them has been uh, exemplary so far. Uh, I do love the combination between uh, PTC and uh, 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 Ginny, which yep. has really been working out wonders for them. But uh, we'll see what uh, Vision Striker can do. They are, seem to be going for the very expensive double op strategy uh, um, as soon as they can. I know they have got two great talents in uh, RB and Zest. Uh, but again, it makes it so damaging if you lose the rounds here. And now they're starting to push it. They want to try and eliminate all of um, the rotation. Glow is all the way here in market side. He might be able to lock things down. Acidic, though, he's going to get the first one onto RB. Rolling as market. Uh, Omen actually got the wall bang. Oh, he got wall bang more like so. Aesthetics, you go in, in there, there's double left. peak, and he goes down as the king. So it's not going to be a two on three. Nice 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 there is possible. PTC gets the fair to stacks. He will be able to be back it out right now. But hey. VS, they are they they only have the Sova left. There's absolutely no way I think that uh, they can probably uh, defend this plan or defuse this plan. Yeah, PTC taking a long way around, but Zess, he is going to be the last yeah. member yet again. Not too sure what he's going to be able to accomplish. He's going to be looking to see yeah. potentially on the exit kills. But, you know, with this uh, loss, which uh, is most certainly going to be coming here for Vision Striker, that means we only have one more round after this in the half. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, given that how we've been talking about uh, Ascent leading o or leaning over towards, you know, more defensive-sided yes. uh, victories, this is not voting well for them as they're going to be moving into that second half. Yep. I mean, I was about to say, like, you could you could be trying to maybe get some frags here, but then again, he is having an operator. Their economy is really not that good right now, so he, he needs that to come back into the game. Hope we have to jump. Oh, we heard that. Oh, that's an op. Omen, Omen action. Better Omen's it, but unfortunately, that Omen was on as well. RP. With those knives as well. Oh, there is more jet on jet action. Let's do this. Um, They are going to make their way to a rotation as well from VS. Coming out in, there is someone in the smoke. He has to be careful, King. Okay, right there, gets the frag onto one apply, one apply drops there. There's two that oh! there is the triple frag. What is going on, King? Holding that on, and then all of a sudden, Jet PTC left alive. There, dro spike drop, I think. Um, but he is on site. He knows that they know where she is. Is that gonna be a corner? But Jet still has an updraft. Well, I don't know what that they can do here, but PTC trying to the nail the fight against it, but can't do it. Was having the aftershock thrown at it. Yes, plays this because I have seen them being like okay. aggressive sometimes. Oh, yeah. no. oh. Now we do have the slow coming here. Fun of fly can't get his aim there though. The smoke he gets blinded. RB gets taken out. Yeah, that's one. That's two. Remain. That's three as well. One of flies on the roll, and all of a sudden vision strike. There's only Omen left standing, and still all members of defenders. Are still up. This is this is a big contrast in power right now. This game. What's going on? Yeah, attack all around. Really living up to uh, the billing here for this game, and uh, also their name being Defense. positioned all around a site. Really <laughs> stitching up everyone expertly. And now there's only going to be Glow that's left. He's actually going to be pushing through all the way towards the spawn. But oh, Ginny's going to spot him out. Only able to hit him once in the head though. And then it's going to need a little bit more. Uh, Ctix, he's going to fancy his chances here with the Shock Dart and looking to try and catch out the player. He knows that this is potential with the Dark Cover being, left. of course, expended. He hears the shots going to be coming Shock through there, but he's still holding strong, but he finally gets it. So it's going to be a whole lot that they can do, but they're going to be playing retake. One of mine still holding strong here on top of uh, the Heaven side of things. Stacks is going to be knowing the tree presence here coming out from Congaret, but uh, not going to be able to get too much done. Plan has gone down, gonna get that money bonus at the very least, but now they're waiting for that five main man retake to happen and the door gonna go down. Yep, thank you, thank you, Observer, giving us that burst. I mean, what's happening? Uh, to PTC spots out, stacks spots RIB as Long well. Enemy Triple enemy. A, what's going on? That rotation is massive. Look at that discipline, that cypher up in heaven holding there, you know, not giving too much information. Congrats takes a fantastic kill on the glow at least, but hey. They got the they got the diffuse off and triple A. It's already a ten four man. I'm looking at at least your game. You gotta go game two. That was a fantastic retake there to to be sure. The I think the recon dart just giving. So
so much intel. And, you know, after being able to push through uh, Door and uh, really take them down with such a long, you know, I mean, yeah, very technical stuff, as you mentioned. Of course, you would expect to see this happen, you know, in this round just because uh, it was a full eco coming out from Vision Strikers. But that's going to enable them even more here to be able to have this gun around. So, again, very swing point here. If they don't win now, it's going to be very difficult for them as Triple A only needs three more rounds here to progress on to map number two. All right, there one recon up mid as well. We do see them taking up catwalk. Was that catwalk? Um, super slow. Cage Get trigger. There. Different camera right now here though. They are gonna congress up to uh Faith garden. But they are all stacking up there on the towards. I'm not sure here. about this. They find one. For his team as well, stacks double shot onto triple A, down goes the omen as well, and those are their controllers. So I'll right now, fine. like Vision Strike is looking area. very good to make an entry uh, plan right now, okay. Um, with Reach, however, Reach can cause some chaos, of course, Jet can cause a lot of confusion as well here though, but hey, that's the PTC, they can onto Zesto, it is a fair 3 on 3 action now. Uh, I think I can they spot out PTC. Right. Yeah, and it's actually going to be really dangerous from there just because of the kind of potential for the wall banks. And we can one see Aftershock also base. going out, but King here, he's going to be able to get one. As he takes also going down, only going to be leaving PTC to try and do it all by himself up there. He's actually going to be moving down, but Stax though, he's got other ideas and he's going to be able to shut him down. Vision as well as uh, through Market, because with the two players prodding out there all the way to Tiles, not a lot they can do, but the Ten shots they're landing left. here for King, he's going to actually be pushing onto A side. Going to be inconsequential here for the B take at the time being, here, but look at PTC planted. coming in here from the spawn side of things. There's going to be the uh, reinforcements coming in from B yep. main after backing out from the tile side, but the plant is already down. Zest going to be hanging out here by Logs. He's going to get flushed out here by the Aftershock, but oh, they're not ready here to catch the player rotating out there. And now look at Zest. He's going to pick up the double there. And now looking very good here to take this round, but it is 2v2 at the moment here. Zest knows that it's still going to be the breach there. He's able to take him down as he's trying to get the fault line to go off. Stacks will be able... Oh, this one on his right though. Monka. That's right, gets one onto King. Oh, he gets it onto King though, but unfortunately, he has two men on him as well. That's information that he Here. needs. Congrats, gets a Sheriff kill onto Stack, that's huge. Of a sudden, Vision Strike, only three men left going up against four A's. I don't know if they can get any entries here. They need to get pickoffs. They do have abilities, they just need to use them. Yeah, so it's a little bit unfortunate. It's damage done here to Vision Strikers on the uh, the attack all round, eco round, not really working out as intended. So. That's again going to be a little bit careful now. They, of course, only bought one Sheriff, but they did manage to take out three of the Vision Striker players in the previous round. So mm -hmm. they did rebuy now. This is going to be a bit difficult for them, even if they do win this round, yeah, to really come shock back dart. from it. But, oh, they spot out a C-Tix here. He's going to be getting the Shock Dart to fall and uh, really just trying to lay as much as possible. You already see rotation coming out here. Jenny's moving through the spawn side of things here. Might be able to catch them out. Glow, though, finally takes down left. the Sova as uh, they're going to all Spike try planted. and defend on site. It is a three. 3v3 situation, but not a lot of weaponry available here. But it uh, looks like Wonderfly is going to be able to pick up some of that juiciness as, uh, of course, they did take down two of their players early on. That is a Bucky. But Bucky action, Zez. You got that. Oh my god, he got it. He gets it. He, we hit those. And that's really important because this is post plant right now. So, uh, getting one down from, uh, from Defenders. Very good. Zez is popping off as usual. Congrats now goes down and now it's just Breach. Breach has been being flushed out. I think he needs to say... It's a Bucky thing. Yeah, I mean, that's a funny thing. No. That ball bank, that's insane. Yeah, just gonna try his best. Very much on the heaven side. They're trying to transition down way. from Garden here into Tree. King might be able to watch things from the catwalk side of things while they are trying to focus here. But PTC missing his shot there. Uh, Glow, though, is still gonna go down. But oh, look, it's gonna be a clean sweep. Congrat doing wonders here as he's gonna be able to pick up the double. RB, he's gonna be left there. He's trying to land the shots there with the blade sword, but not a lot that he can do there. He will be able to take one, but Congrat, he's gonna be the hater on, or at the very yeah. least, they can stall before, you know, they commit to an oh, aggressive uh, um, uh, start here, but uh, Congret and PTC, though, they're going to be able to get the opening picks here, and working wonders as they're going to really get the angles there on towards top mid. Not a whole lot that uh, Vision Strikers is getting done here, and we're seeing singular players running in here. I'm not sure what King was trying to do there, and now they're going to be completely disjointed, not in any okay. place ready for the trades. Alright, that's really though, I mean, like, the, I mean, Jet still has the bomb, they're still trying to clear sites. The, the sites are still okay. 
thus far because obviously Triple A is having the man advantage here. But um, oh, RB, edge onto SX, actually dwindling down the numbers of Triple A. RB on site now. Triple A is rotating over to B. Spike planted. Here they know he's on CT side. Okay, spots out stack. So stack walking. That stack was blinded. And down he goes, offside is a jet solo defending. Can exactly he clutch it out here? He is one of the most mobile agents in the game. Gets one, gets two. Nah, I am so sorry he does not get two. Yeah, unfortunate there for RB trying his best. This is gonna be map point here for attack all around. Looking really impressive here to start this tie and to, you know, Spike Vision Striker. They have Fred here, given the kind of form that we're seeing coming out from the Thai team. So it might just be them wanting to really steady the ship while they uh, uh, get mentally prepared here for the next one. But PTC, he's got other ideas. He's going to take this aggressive angle here. And he's going to get two for his trouble. And just really not going to be denied from being the absolute thorn in the side of Vision Striker. Now that aggressive peak is going to yield the information that there's probably going to be more players weighted over to this A side than not. And you can already see that they're going to be in position to rotate. But Glow, he's going to go for the aggressive peak here. Third time is the charm. And then he's going to be pushing in dark cover. Going to be working in his favor. But there's still a Rolling Thunder available here. And he's going to get completely knocked off his feet.